Uh, how's everyone? Can we close that, please? We got stats? We don't get them yet? <coughs> First and foremost, uh, thank the Lord for allowing all this to transpire. It's a good old fashioned buck kicking. It's no excuses, no nothing. Um, their coaches did a heck of a job preparing their team. Obviously, we didn't. That was good. I mean, that was a really good old fashioned buck kicking. Uh, we went into the game wanting to dominate several, wanting to dominate several phases. Um, we lost offensively, defensively, as well as special teams. That fake punt kind of, kind of got them really rolling, and uh, they didn't stop. Um, ever since they secured that first down, well coached team. Uh, Bo Nix played his butt off. Defensively, they presented some things that I guess we just couldn't get around. We couldn't advance the ball rushing or uh, throwing the ball as well. Seemed like they had our number. But hats off to their coaching staff, to their head coach. Great job, and they're truly prepared. How you doing, Ari? Excellent. No, you can't wipe the slate clean. You got to watch the film and evaluate. I'll do that on the plane, but I, I saw a lot of it live. Just uh, players that weren't in position that didn't do the job that we expected. You evaluate players, you evaluate coaches, you evaluate everything when it's a game of that nature. And you had no opportunity to win, period, from the kickoff on. Brian, go ahead. Hey, Coach, yeah, you mentioned that the last couple of weeks. That yes, sir. You guys aren't doing well. Yeah. No, you don't need to hammer home a player. A player knows. I mean, he could fool himself and trick himself, but when he looks at the mirror, he knows what he's looking at. Um, something like this is, is – I'm not going to say – you know, people around the country would say this is what they needed to humble themselves. We wasn't arrogant or whatever. We just – we're confident people. If our confidence offends your insecurity, that's a problem with you. It's not us. Uh, we expect to do well. We expect to play well. We expect to win every game we step out there. We expect to practice to perfection and go out there and uh, execute the things that we practice. We just didn't do it today. But uh, it's not something that was needed. It's just like saying you get in a car wreck or something. Oh, he needed that to slow him down. You don't need that. That's just stupid. It's just something that happened, and we, they got the best of us today. That's just it. No, no, no. We were, uh, it's not like it was. we were being tricked. We knew everything was coming. After, even after one of the TV times out, TV timeout, we were saying, oh, they're going to take a shot. They're going to take a shot. They took a shot. They scored a touchdown. I mean, sometimes uh, your message just don't translate. You, you, you got to really get on the same page as the youngsters is out there playing. No, definitely not. If we had a talent gap, we wouldn't be three and one right now. And it's not a talent gap. That's a you just got your butt kicked. It just happens sometimes. That's just like a, a, a fighter. You just got caught. It happens. It's not a huge talent gap. I don't. I, I, I just think they, they played a really concise game. Penalties murdered us. I don't have the statistics, but I'm pretty darn sure we darn near doubled them in penalties. We don't – usually we are really sound, fundamentally t sound team. We don't make foolish mistakes and uh, implement danger or harm on ourselves. Uh, Field position wise, we just kept just, just kept making mistakes. That's not indicative of who we are. How much was Travis missing? Travis always going to be missed. He's the best darn uh, football player in college football. How, how is he not missed? It's just like saying you write an article and your pen is missing. <laughs> That's how much he means. Yes, go. I'm not going to say that. You don't always have to get your butt kicked to learn. You can win and learn. I mean, that's not something to learn. It's, it's something to glean from. It's not just the kids. The coaches are accountable, too. We are all accountable. Let's start with me. We're accountable for this. It's not just the kids. What are the, that you? Uh, the way we play. 
That really surprised me. We played like hot garbage. That surprised me. I didn't expect that. I got to watch the film. I mean, sometimes he is, sometimes the route, sometimes the call, sometimes the blocking. So it's, it's, a, it's a whole lot goes into that. So you really have to watch film to really dictate and, and understand what transpired on that specific play. It's a lot goes on in the play. What's the message to the team? Get your butt up and let's go. We ain't got time to have no pity party. Ain't nobody walk around the locker room with napkins and tissues. Get your butt up. Let's get on that plane. Let's go. We got work to do. I guess on a positive note, you had some guys play today for the first time. Mm -hmm. Is it good to get some of those guys finally going? You know, all the men no, because that means you got your butt kicked. When you start putting guys in at the end, that means you got your butt kicked. No. Yeah, I mean, you wanted them to play, but I mean, no. Well, we, we had to score. We, we, we had tremendous opportunities all game long, but it seems like we just kept shooting ourselves in the foot. And every time it gets something going, here we go with another penalty. Here we go with another holding. Here we go with just something. Um, we just got to perform better, much better in every phase, not just offense, defense, as well as special teams. We got our butts kicked again, I reiterate, in all three phases. Say that one. Sorry, yeah, the offensive distribution for the Ducks on the ground and through the air was pretty even. Yeah. What aspect of Oregon's defense did you struggle with most today? Um, they got to our quarterback. They got to our quarterback. When you get to our quarterback, it's, it's a wrap because it's not like we're running the ball successfully. So we got to we gotta throw. Let, let them ask a couple more. Okay. I, ain't, I ain't got nowhere to go. So. <laughs> Well, there's only two things happen. I mean, the fake punt that they ran, and, and uh, I think they blocked the field goal. I, how do how you block uh, – not field goal, I'm sorry, extra point. How do you block an extra point? How do you not – and I asked Mata what happened. He just said he put his head up. He didn't, he didn't get the ball up. So he took ownership of that. But I'm like, come on, man, don't kick yourself. This game is out of reach. Don't, don't, don't ponder that. You're a great kicker, and you're going to come and do some phenomenal things for us this, this season. And this is the kind of opportunity you have as a coach, as a man, as a father, to lift them up. Not just shoot them down. You got to lift them up. Right. I don't think it's a target on our back. I just think this just this just teams are trying to beat me. They're not trying to beat our team. They keep forgetting I'm not playing anymore. I had a great career. I'm serious. I got a gold jacket. Ain't back. So I'm good. But that's what it really is. I don't think they get any uh, extra satisfaction, you know. It is what it is. And I, I signed up for it, so let's go. No, they don't make it tougher on our team. These are grown men. I'm not out there. If I was out there playing against every coach I played against, we would be totally dominant. Coach, you may mention the other day, the first day was in town, that you're about seven to eight dogs away. Yeah. I wasn't lying. I wasn't lying. I didn't. Uh, it translates in practice. It is, I don't say stuff just to say it for a click, you know, contrary to what some may say. But, uh, I, yeah, I, get, I keep receipts. Uh, but I'm serious. I analyze and I understand what we're up against and what we have and what we need. One thing that I could say honestly and candidly, you better get me right now. This is the worst we're going to be. You better get me right now. Now, somebody, yeah, I, I got messengers. God bless him, though, man. He's a great coach. He did a great job. God bless him. He take their shots. They won. I don't shoot. I don't do that. They won. Anything else for coach? You talk about needing to build them up a little bit. Excuse me? You talked about sort of needing to build them up after this result. How do you find the balance between the couple of Well, I, I think the film is going to speak for itself when they watch the film with their position coaches and um, as the offense and the defense. But – Singularly, you, you're able to pull some guys aside and, and pick them up and, and, and highlight some of the, the good things that they did. Everyone didn't play bad. Everyone didn't play bad. That's not the good. Every coach didn't coach bad. You know, that's not the case as well. But we got some work to do. And uh, you better get us right now because I like what I see. I, I love the. I know I have on shades, but I can see the future. And it looks really good. So I'm, I'm excited about it. I really am. Thank you. God bless you all, man. Be safe.